there's a wealth of steps involved in the app development process and decisions to make when it comes to bringing your app to life, including how to find the best mobile app development company. In fact, this is one of the most important decisions you'll make in your journey to building an app. Hi, I'm Ryan from Webiotic. In this video, we'll take a look at the choices available to you and how to make the right one. Hiring an app developer to build your mobile app is a big endeavor, especially when you consider all the options available. You can hire a freelancer, an established mobile app development company, or a small boutique app development firm. And then there's the question of hiring onshore or offshore. Let's go through the options. Freelancer. A freelancer typically works solo. Some entrepreneurs choose to work with a freelancer or freelancers to cut costs, but this generally isn't recommended, especially for bigger projects. App Development Company You can never go wrong working with a large and established mobile app development company. They generally have a team of professionals who are experts in their field, whether it's app development, design, and testing to app marketing and publishing. App Development Boutique Boutique shops typically consist of a very small team that take on a smaller number of mobile app development projects and are often specialized in a specific app niche or industry. It's going to cost you a lot more than what a single freelancer would charge, but it won't be as expensive as hiring a big company with many employees. Whether you decide to work with a freelancer or an app development company, there are tons of options available all over the world. Hiring onshore means that the freelancer or company you work with is located in the same country as you. The cost for hiring onshore is typically higher, but comes with a lower risk. Hiring offshore means that you're working with people located in another country. Offshore app development will most often be located in India, Pakistan, or the Philippines. The cost for hiring offshore is typically lower, but comes with a higher risk. Here are some tips to find the best app development company. Review portfolios. A company's portfolio should be the first thing you check out when scoping out talent. A portfolio will showcase what projects they've worked on in the past and will give a valuable insight into their level of expertise and knowledge in the industry. Read client reviews. While some developers will display client reviews right on their website, it's always better to check third-party review websites like Glassdoor or Clutch. These kinds of websites will offer real reviews from real clients, and they may also include other important information like price range, location, team size, and more. Measure their communication skills. Even if you find an app developer who's incredibly talented at coding, if they're lacking in communication skills, this could turn your project into a nightmare. Communication is key to ensuring your project runs smoothly, so gauge on how well your candidates communicate with you know their range of services. When working with a single developer, it's very unlikely that you're going to find someone who specializes in every step of the app development process. There's not only coding to think about, but marketing, SEO, ASO, testing, and more. When reviewing potential hires, make it clear what services you're looking for and whether or not you can count on them to deliver everything you need. In the end, the company you choose to work with is your choice, and there is no right or wrong answer, as everyone's needs are different. Take time to consider the goals of your company, review candidates both near and far, talk to developers, talk to agencies. I hope you learned something today about how to choose a mobile app development company. For more help with your app, subscribe to our channel. If you like this video, please like it and share it with others. Thank you for watching.